Hey, um, I'd, I'd like to publicly apologize. There were some whispers and some gossip. I ran with it and I shouldn't have, okay? You know, this, this, this whole nonsense, I, I was leading the charge on this. I'm sorry, man. I had a bad experience with a guy in my unit when I was overseas who was not who he claimed to be. And that's my problem, that's not yours. You're a solid dude and a good cop. So whatever happened to the gang unit, doesn't matter, all right? Man to man and to the whole team, um, I'm sorry. Yeah, you can count me in on that too. My bad, dog. The sister of one of the gang unit cops was beat up after she turned in a banger for robbing her place. ASA didn't have enough to convict the guy who did it, so Rixton's unit went after him. But Kenny wasn't with him. Two cars belonging to other members of the unit were spotted by plate readers one block from where the payback beating went down at the same time it happened. Oh, and one of those one of those cars was approached by a patrolman who was told they were on a narcotics thing, but they'd already clocked out. So it had to be a lie. That's how they got caught, not by anything Kenny did. I was approached by IAD, but I turned down a deal and I never said a word. Not that my unit believed me. Well, why didn't you just say that in the first place? Because I told him not to. We were working a case. Plus, his last unit iced him out over a rumor. I wanted to see if you guys were any better. How do we do? I'll see you at Molly's. Assignment? Uh, it's over. Yeah. Listen, uh, I kind of ran from intelligence. I'll admit, I, I wasn't ready to work side by side with you. It was stupid. It's like my family up there. I'd really like to come back. Okay. Is that okay with you? Yes. You sure? Yes. Okay, because that was kind of quick. Yes. Welcome back. 